In this tutorial, we're going to look at how we can display line numbers in SQL Server Management Studio when using SQL Server, uh, why this is beneficial, um, and, and sort of a real world example. So we have a stored procedure here, a script for a stored procedure, and when we try and execute a portion, we see we get an error. Now, it points to a line, and this is the case. Usually things may not be so clear um, in a real-world case, um, and we need to try and decipher um, errors by the line number. So we can actually show line numbers in SQL Server Management Studio by clicking on Options within Tools um, at the top ribbon. And then we want to go into Text Editor. We then can click on Transact SQL, and in general, we have the option to enable line numbers. We can check that box. We don't need to refresh um, SSMS. We can just look in and we have the line numbers. So at line number 24, it said was our error. We can see um, that we've placed a comma. It might not be so obvious in other examples, but the line number is a good quick method to try and solve errors um, in a fast manner. As usual, if you like this content, please feel free to like, comment, subscribe, and share. Thank you.